friends, welcome back to my channel. It's Winnie BLV, Mouth of the South. No intro, no outro. It's just this whole happy 2021. The new year's finally here. We have such high hopes for 2021, but I can remember 2019 being kind of hinky for me. So I can remember last year on the new year thinking, oh my gosh, 2020 is going to be so great. Mm, yeah. So We've gotten through it. Let's just uh, let's hold hands and move on together. Happy New Year to you. Uh, hopefully you are having a great week or end of the week or weekend as it were. If you've just stumbled upon this channel uh, and you want to see an old ladies ranting and raving, stick around. I just talk about luxury stuff that's not luxury too. Um, I talk about a lot of things, but I like luxury, so I focus on that a lot. I try to tell stories, and along the way, I try to be funny. Um, sometimes it happens, sometimes it does not. We've got our fingers crossed for today, so stick around. I'm going to show you what I got for Christmas from my people, my husband, my kids, my mom, um, my sister. I might just tell you some things instead of showing you everything. Um, but, you know, I got a lot of nice things this year. Um, I was very, very blessed and happy to do so. Uh, hopefully you had a nice holiday season as well. Uh, I saw another YouTuber telling a story about how she got um, a Rolex and I've had one for years and years. Uh, and I have not had it on in years and years, hence you can tell it's, it is screaming to get off my, I can remember when I got this, it was a gift from my dad years and years ago. Um, there was, I had to take it back and have some of the links taken out because it was too, it was, you know, too loose. And I kind of like mine to stay on my arm, but this is crazy. This is like an arm girdle right now. This damn thing is screaming, let me off. But yeah, um, she tight. Okay. She tight. Mm, that's what he said. So anyhow, moving right along. I got a comment the other day from somebody that said, just simply said, you talk too much. And I was like, what do you want me to do on here, guys? What, what a, Yeah, that's no fun. What the hell? Uh, I talk too much. You're an a-hole. We're even. Guys, so I finally, finally, two days ago, got a coach animation that I had ordered for. I kind of half ordered it for myself. I kind of half ordered it for someone else. And then when it didn't come, that put the icing on the cake. But it was just the gift set. This went on sale really big in like the beginning or middle of December. I ordered it. Um, I am going to keep it now because it's too late to gift someone, you know, the whole Santa gift thing. So I did get this in a roundabout way. I bought it for myself. And a lot of these gifts are stuff that I bought myself. Um, with that came this little item and I love, I love this in so many ways. Um, but I have to tell you when I bought it, I did not realize that this thing was as dated as it is. You'll see why. It was 10 bucks and it, it actually, it sent me an, an email or no, a text. And you know, you get those coach outlet texts and it said, hey, big sale. I don't know when it was, I can't, two weeks ago or so. And I thought, oh, it's a, it's a holiday luggage tag. That'll go good with my um, coach animation stuff. But you guys see what it is? It's from 2019. I did not realize it. I still did not realize it until I looked at it two or three times when it came in and I was like, wait, hold on. Oh, this is why it was 10 bucks. Okay, I get it now. But it's it's so cute. Um, I really don't care that it says 2019. 2019 was an okay year too, so we're going to, you know, carry on. I guess they thought they can't bear to remember 2020 will... We'll give these back out. I don't know. Should have given me this one for free, though, guys. This one has expired. Y'all know I bought myself the Coach little uh, makeup bag. I found it, and I have put the little handles on it, or the little strap on it, so I can carry it. Um, that was a good gift that I bought myself. 
You've seen this one. So, my husband, everybody has asked me and texted me and, you know, messaged me. What, what did Bill get you? What did Bill... So, this is a complicated thing. Bill is the kind of gift giver that, um, if he knows I'm going on and on and on about something, I have to literally drone on about it for years before he... Oh, you want one of the... He's not a very thoughtful gift giver in that respect. I mean... He will get me something and sometimes hand me money and say, go get it, or just tell me to order whatever it is. So in that respect, he, he'll get flowers, he'll give me jewelry if I say, this is what I want, and he says, go order it. That's how it works. So I basically order stuff for myself, and then I tell him, you got me this. So there wasn't a whole lot that went on with that this year. I do have um, a haul video. <laughs> Next week, hopefully, that I'll show you uh, something that I got on Christmas Eve that I ordered from the Louis Vuitton website. I ended up sending it back. I did not love it. And, guys, you know, if I'm going to spend that much on a bag or something, I have to love it. I just can't just let it sit anymore in my trophy case. I've done that in the past, and look, no, mm -mm, she's not going to do it. So, in a roundabout way, he did buy me that because he was... He knew I was excited. I actually told him about it. I know. I broke my own rules. Didn't tell him the actual price. Uh, but I broke my own rules and told him, yeah, I bought this. And he was like mad at first, but then he was like, well, that's what you'll get for Christmas. So me sitting that back, there's, I, I'm going to replace it, but that's all coming up in a haul video. But he did buy me this jacket. Does it look familiar? It's cute. It came from Walmart and um, Walmart.com. It's one that Yota showed on her channel and she bought herself. Um, and the XL did fit me, so I was very happy about that. But I thought this was really cute. Um, he was like, you kind of look like your grandma in it. And I was like, that's what I was going for because I am be becoming a grandma. So it's got the little silvery things and I just thought it was cute. It's just, I don't know. It's just so... I don't know, old school or furry, fake furry. I don't know. I loved it. I thought it was really cute. And it was cheap. It was like 30 bucks. So he did buy me that. I did tell him that, you know what? You bought me a jacket. And he was like, okay. So there's that. Um, he bought me a scarf, which um, it's just a soft, soft scarf. I do like it, but, um, you know, self-explanatory, it's, just a scarf, guys. Um, he bought me some gloves. Uh, and again, remember, I bought all these things and then said to him, hey, you bought me. So he knows about these things. And my, my jacket's blown up. Um, but he didn't specifically go and pick these out. But whatever. They're mine, right? <laughs> now, I bought this thing with... Okay, so I bought this at the end of November on Amazon and I fully wanted to do a collab video with Yota uh, or Autumn or all of them um, but they didn't want to order this so in the end I had already ordered it and was stuck with it and so now here we go. I am going to show it to you guys. I looked online on Amazon but they didn't have these anymore. Um, they were unavailable. It still shows that you can buy them. It just says that they're all sold out. But it is just a book tote that I will probably end up gifting someone. Um, but I wanted to show this in a video and I thought, when will I get a chance to show it other than now? So there we go. I did buy this for myself. Turns out I, I don't care for it. I did buy this little necklace, which is um, a very cheap, cheap necklace from Amazon. I think it was in the nature of 10 bucks along the lines of that. It's got a little lock on it and it's got my initial W on there which I thought was cute. I just thought this was something you know adorable. I bought this a few weeks ago and I haven't worn it so voila it is now something for Christmas. My daughter is very thoughtful. She knows that I like to switch up and change my mask so she got me sort of holiday themed looking this um, buffalo plaid is that what it's called? These are Old Navy masks, and they're adjustable, and I really thought this was cute. Green, and then the checked one. 
So I will be wearing these. They're pretty thin. I like them. She knows that I love, uh, I used to love Scentsy a lot. I like the, to come in the house and have a nice smell hit you instead of, you know, <laughs> feet and ass. Uh, but I like to mask that smell. <laughs> so I have dogs. So um, she bought me a bunch of these little things. They're called Wallflowers from Bath and Body. And I have these little plugins now all over the house because my Scentsy lady went, I don't know where she went. She just stopped selling. So um, she got me a bunch of these in different, this one's flannel, cinnamon stick, which is my favorite, cinnamon and clove, which is also one of my favorite. I like um, cinnamony smells, black tie. Uh, this one's frosted forest. Uh, I don't really like sugary sweet like food smells. I, I don't know why. It makes me hungry. Maybe. I, I just don't. Um, my mom got me another pair of pajamas. My son and uh, his old lady <laughs> got me um, a gift card to Red Lobster just because um, I've always loved Red Lobster. I like seafood. Uh, and my mom got me, or maybe my mom got me that, no, no, yeah, my mom got me the Red Lobster card, and then, um, my son got me an Outback, because I like a Blooming Onion, and those are two of my favorite places to go, um, and get to go orders now, so, there you go. I bought, um, the girls, <laughs> this sweater, um, the Cha-Cha sweater from L&M online and um I just I just love it I thought it was cute um I bought this for myself in roundabout way I guess it could be for my husband yeah a friend gave me this little walk that is adorable uh, it's got the little handle on here and so I'm tickled I will be so happy to carry this got a nice long chain on it. It's got the little pocket on the back. Um, loving that. Definitely going to carry that. So I meant to tell you what my sister got me. So I got two new candles. My mom got me this one. It's called Woodwick in Lavender Spa. Girl, it smells so good. It's got that special kind of wick on it that crackles. It says it, I don't really, I'm going to have to read about this, but um, it's really cute. This patented wick design offers soothing crackle, fast fragrance, and better burn. It's one thing I want. It's better burn, girl. <laughs> and so my sister got me this one. It's kind of a holiday themed, um, and it smells really good, too. It really smells like Christmas. It really does. Where are you, Christmas? It's right here in this damn candle, yo. Uh, I miss Christmas when it's over. Do you guys? I kind of have a sort of like melancholy feeling like it's going to be another year. It's roughly only 11 months, guys. Um, so yeah, this one's called Balsam and Fur. I got the fur if you got the balsam. <laughs> I don't even... Balsam? Oh, nothing. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, and my sister also gave me a really nice basket, which was um, mostly consumables, hot chocolate, uh, crackers, cookies, all kinds of stuff. There was a really plush blanket that we've already gotten out and used. Um, it was in this beautiful basket, so she did well. Um, so thank you to my sis for that. So yeah, there we go. And I got this. You guys know what this is? This is a casserole dish carrier. <laughs> and I had it in red, but I don't have it anymore. And I got to looking for that thing for the last seven or eight months. My mom came over for Thanksgiving and she was carrying my red casserole dish carrier, which I had asked her several times, like, do you have that of mine? Have I left it at your house? No, no, I don't have it. Mm. She did have it, and when I said, oh, you've got my casserole dish carrier, and she was like, no, I don't. That's mine. Your sister brought me that. I was like, okay. Um, so, I just let her keep it, and um, I went on Target for Black Friday, and I got myself this one in green. They didn't have the red anymore, 
but it's the exact same thing and if it makes my mom happy she can have the red one and now I've got a green one don't get it twisted though <clears throat> Bish will be putting her name up on this okay yes go off sis <laughs> I'm definitely marking my territory from now on so everybody wants to know what is your wish list for 2021 it's a simple simple list I would like to have this year um, a Cartier love band not a bracelet but just a love band kind of like my little Tiffany band here um, I've never owned anything from Cartier so I thought that would be fun and wear it on my ring finger um, just I just thought that would be a nice gift maybe sometime this year I'll get that um, I do want a super mini Gucci the little tiny Gucci bag. Um, I don't even know if I want that or even smaller, the coin. They make a coin that looks like that with a little heart on the back. I want one of those. Um, that's on my list this year. It's not a whole, um, I would love to have one of those heart bags, the Cure or something. I don't know what they call it, but it's the Game On collection with the little heart. I would love to have a Louis Vuitton monogram heart bag. That would be great. Um, also, I still want the Speedy Mini. I would still like to have the red handle Louis Vuitton all-in bag. I never bought that for myself, that big, huge tote. I don't know why. I like little tiny bags, but I feel like if I had that, it would be all good, right? Um, I do want that. So there's not really, I still want a Treville. I think these were on my list last year and I didn't get them and I didn't really think I was going to either, but uh, a Treville, the multi, um, I would love to have that. So those are basically the things that I would like to get this year. I don't know if I will. Um, also a pair of Gucci Ace sneakers in some form or fashion. I don't care if they're the traditional kind. They say love on them. They've got strawberries. I don't really care what kind they are. I just want to have a Gucci pair of sneakers. And Ace sneakers are about, you know, the most common kind that you see. And I do want them to have like a different color on each side. I think that's cool. I like that. That's cute. So anyway, what is your wish list? Tell me down below. I'd love to know what you are uh, wanting this year and putting on your wish list. So I hope you guys um, have a great 2021. Here's to looking at a great 2021. I do appreciate and love all of you that have watched all of the crazy uh, on my channel this last year. I hope you will continue to watch and we will continue to be friends. Um, I've gotten to know several of you through the channel, also through texting and Instagram and Facebook, and I think all of you guys are great. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I have got to go and get this watch off of my arm before it cuts off my circulation. It's like a tourniquet now. And also, um, yeah, I think I'm going to need the jaws of life. It's like... Can you imagine the indention that's going to happen? Oh, well. I got to wear my watch. I am going to have to put the little things back in, though, right? Yeah, that's definitely going to have to happen. Or I could lose weight this year. <laughs> I'm going to continue to walk. That's as far as I'm going with any resolutions. All right, guys. Remember, if y'all see my husband, don't tell him nothing. Bye. Guys, I have always wanted to do this. Look around. Ta-da! Can you guys believe that I let this room get that dang dirty? You nasty! <laughs>